Hello, Jules. Welcome back to Day 7. We're recording this on Day 8, but, you know, I was very busy the day before, so I'm kind of cheating, but I can tell you what happened. Alrighty, so welcome back to Day 7 of the One a Day Art Journal for the 365 days of the year that we're going to hopefully try and keep up with this year. So, uh, today's theme is we're going to be talking about giving thanks. And this is a block stamp that I got from uh, Miss Wanda Bailey. And um, we're giving thanks to Mother Nature and what she has given us. And I am going to be using some butterflies and I'm going to be using some embossing, um, uh, embossing powder. Sorry, I'm, always, I'm so used to turning it upside down. Yeah. Y'all can see it like this now. Uh, we're going to be using some embossing powder, and we're going to be using some Distress Oxide Sprays. What is this one? So, I'm going to go ahead and shake this up. And I'm going to spray this real quick, and then I'm going to dry it. Plastic off of this before I used it. <laughs> All right, so we're going to dry that real quick. That's the, uh, the runoff of black chalk, and so you've got a little bit of residue on your hands. So I'm going to flip that over because we're going to be using that. Now, um, I'm going to go ahead and fussy cut these cute little butterflies out. But again, the title of this is Giving Thanks. Who all do you have to give thanks for? Is it your mom, your dad, your grandparents, your aunts, your uncles? Somebody in your family or a friend, a very, very close friend that you can be thankful for. Who, who do you have? Uh, who do you have to be thankful for in your life? Do you have a kitty cat that gets in your lap? And purrs and, and purrs and purrs and purrs and you pet on them because they know you're having a bad day. Are you thankful for those kitties that jump in your lap? Or do you have a puppy that gets in your face and gives you kisses? Because all animals can tell if you're having, an, having a bad day. And they just want to make you happy. So don't get mad at them, them cute little cuddly creatures. They get in your face and give you cuddles and, and, and licks and kisses. Me, I have a lot to be thankful for. I have my family, my wonderful YouTube family as well. All the people that support me and um, James Lee. We have food on our tables and thank goodness a job to help put food on our tables. We have a lot of people that help us out with uh, food and supplies if we ever need it. We have a uh, wonderful company that um, that helps supply food when we, we can. Um, out here it's very local. It's a church-based group so we have a little bit of help from them to help supply and put food on our tables, thank goodness. If it wasn't for them, sometimes we wouldn't have food on our tables. So, thank you. Um, I think I think the uh, the Christians out there that help give me support through the really bad times and give me sound advice on what I what I need and should do. 
I'm thankful for a lot of things. I'm thankful for the wonderful advice that my parents gave me when I was younger because I wouldn't be who I am today if it wasn't for my parents. Would you be would you be who you are right now if it weren't for your parents or your uh, the family that raised you? Would you be who you are today? I know I wouldn't be because there's a lot of life lessons that my parents taught me and I have to say some of them were really hard to swallow. It's like you ever took a pill that was really hard to swallow? No. Some of these life lessons were like really hard to swallow and hard to take as a child. I didn't understand it then. I thought my parents were the cruelest and meanest people on earth, but guess what? They meant well, and guess what? We took it. We took it to our adulthood. Well, some of us did. We took it to our adulthood. Now, we may we may have made uh, mistakes growing up, but you know what? Those mistakes are who we are and what made us who we are. So I'm thankful for those mistakes. Some of them are not good. Some of them, some of them are good, but a learning curve. Learning experience, I should say. I had a few doozies. And some of them I wish I would have never done. But, you know, again, I'm thankful for those bad times and things that I did because it made me wisen up and, and think, of, think about things before I did them again, you know? There are some things that I'm still doing, but, you know, it's still learning. I'm thankful for the mistakes I'm making, you know. You learn from them. Let's see, what else am I thankful for? Um, let's see, I'm thankful for the, again, the people in my life. Because if it wasn't, if it weren't for some of the people that I've met through the last couple of years, I don't think that I would be making some of the, uh, the right decisions. I mean, they have given me some really good advice on what I, I should do. And they have taught me a lot. Taught me quite a bit. And I wouldn't change any of that for nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. I've met some of the, the wonderful folks that, that I have role modeled uh, from. I mean, I may not have met some of them personally, but I have talked to them on Facebook personally there, seen their face, talked to them personally. I have met them there. In that way. All right, so we have our little butterflies cut out. Alright, now we are going to be using some of our, our embossing powder. And we are going to stamp this real pretty butterfly here. So that's my ink ink. Okay, so, let's juice this up. And then we are going to put that... You see that there. You see that it worked. Alright, so now we're going to put some of our embossing powder on it. Oh, that's got some lumps in it. Yeah, let's, let's get the lumps out. How about we have a smooth, 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 smooth. Alright, so we're going to just sprinkle that on there, just cover it completely up. And we're going to dump it off. So now you have this beautiful white and silver butterfly. And I'm going to put this embossing powder back into its bottle. to 
use our heat tool to set that. Beautiful heat set boss butterfly. Look at that. Look how gorgeous that is. Let's get that a minute to cool. Alright, so now we are going to stamp this beautiful bird bath here in the center or in the bottom. Really the way the butterfly shows its shows it's moving away from the butterfly. Or butter butter Hey, y'all smack me. I can't talk today. Nursing another headache. You know, I, be, I get them every single day for some reason. About the same time every day. And I don't know why. But anyway, we're going to stamp this down here. We're just going to use plain Jane black ink. We'll just stamp that right cheap. And then we put the back on there. Move those out of the way. We're going to place these butterflies. You know what? I think I'm going to put the little swirly really stuff on. So we're going to just glue these onto the paper. I'm going to use some good glue. I used quite a bit of it yesterday and almost glued the thing closed. Alright, so let's glue these pretty things down. And another thing I can give thanks for is our wonderful Mother Nature. I think she's on menopause or something because I don't think she knows if she wants to be cold or if she wants to be hot. I don't know. So, um, yeah. Let's put that up. Let's see. What are we gonna? We gotta. We put that right there, and so we we'll put this little butterfly right there. Give thanks to all the wonderful food that our farmers are growing, and we are actually growing a garden out back, and so we've got we're growing some fresh food. It's not really in our garden. We racked up last year with some okra. We planted extra okra to sell to our uh, our corner farmer, farmers, small, very very small farmers market type thing. They're always looking for uh, for fresh for fresh grown things. And I'm going to emboss this in right here. And it's going to go right here. So we're going to be giving thanks right there. It, ladies, very short and simple and quick. You're giving thanks to the small things in the world. Alrighty, guys, 
I will see you guys on the next video. And I thank you uh, for coming and watching uh, this video. And I will see you guys on the next round. Alright guys. Bye.